I just saw somebody spit on the ground in my rear view mirror and it was like a big wad of spit because they're like all the way back there. You can't see in here, but it's like quite a distance and I could still see a huge glob of glob. So I gotta be quick. Um, I wanna get some photos of some sneakers. They're like uh, environmental lifestyle type photos. Um, just kind of experimenting and trying to see what I can do with a kit lens. Um, and I've got about 30 minutes before I have to go. So I only got 30 minutes. Um, I'm trying to get like maybe four photos that I'm happy with, three or four photos that I'm happy with. That's my goal. Um, and so we'll see what happens. I should probably mention that these are not new shoes. They are used. And although I did edit the photos, I didn't make any attempts to make them look, the shoes look newer than they actually are. Um, the purpose of the video really is to see what kind of product photos I could get with a kit lens and with my environment and just whatever I could figure out. But um, I wasn't too worried about making the shoes look newer than they are. And I don't have a brand new pair of shoes. I haven't been shoe shopping in a while, so it is what it is. Um, yeah. Hold on just a second. Meet you off of tripod here and so at this point over here um the main light source was behind the sneakers the sneakers were being backlit and the front part of the sneakers were not getting any sort of light they were in the shadows so I used the flashlight from my phone to get some light on the front side of the shoe, and uh, this is how it came out. I turned around to leave, but then I saw this spot, and I thought that that background was pretty cool, so I decided to put the sneakers up above that and see how that turned out. And then, again, I was about to leave, but then I noticed the yellow lines, and I figured that would be a cool uh, color to complement the color of the shoes. Still doing pretty good with time, but I only got like uh, 15 minutes left. I spent the first 15 in the parking lot. When I left the garage, it came up on these um, statues over here and I thought that could make a cool backdrop. I don't totally love how this shot came out because I, I think it's kind of boring to be honest, but. Now over here, I was in direct sunlight and the light was, it was pretty bright in this spot. I wanted to leave the aperture wide open to get the background out of focus and really focus on the sneakers, but this was a pretty bright spot. It was pretty sunny, so I decided to throw the ND filter on the lens to cut out some of that light. When I came over here, I kind of saw the shot that I wanted in my head. I was kind of thinking things, but this didn't quite come out the way I wanted. But then I changed my perspective just a little bit and got this one. It's all right. It's, um, I think it's better than the first one, but it's, I guess, not necessarily my favorite. And then I went downstairs and got this shot. This might be my favorite of all the photos I took. So then I was running out of time. I turned around to leave, and then I saw this staircase curving in two different directions. And I wanted to see what I could do with that and then ended up getting the worst shot of the evening. But then I turned and saw these bushes and got this shot. But then I really had to get out of there. All right, so I made it to work on time. I did stay two minutes later than I should have uh, going around with that last picture, but I did make it. Um, I don't know yet, of course, if the sh how the shots came out or not. I haven't been home to edit them and 
I don't like to judge until I actually see them on my computer on the big screen. So, um, but I'm sure you know by now. I've, I'm, I've probably thrown them in there. I don't know. And I'll throw them up here again. So, uh, yeah. Hopefully they came out good. <sighs> oh, there's a, there's a bug on me. Uh, but yeah, hopefully they came out good. Um, I'm at work. I'm here to work out. I've got my pre-workout with me. So, uh, yeah. I just saw somebody spit on the ground.